Kvietchen, April. The word Kvietchen comes from the verb Kvietchitsche, which comes from Old Slavic, Kvietim, meaning to bloom. As the name would suggest, Kvietchen sees a great deal of flora re-emerging across the Polish landscape. Though while spring may have officially started, you'll find the weather still remains a little mixed. As the saying goes, Kvetchen plechen bobsche plate, trocha zime, trocha lata. April is a plate, for it is intertwined. A little winter, a little summer. Without a doubt, the most important cultural event in Kvetchen is Wielkanoc, or Easter. And as expected, devoutly Catholic Poland gets right into it. Things kick off in the days before Palm Sunday, or Niedziela Palmowa, with symbolic palms being sold all over the country for the devout to have blessed at their next Mass. Keep in mind, however, that the Polish climate doesn't exactly support the natural growth of palms, and an alternative of dried woven plants and flowers are used instead. The impressive craftsmanship of these religious decorations are celebrated in numerous competitions across the country, most notably in Lipnica Murovana in the country's south. Another popular craft during the Wielkanoc period is the decoration of hard-boiled eggs, or pisanki. Traditional dyeing methods with beetroot, red cabbage and onion skins are particularly popular in addition to a scratch decoration method called drapanki. On the Saturday before Niedziela Wielkanocna, or Easter Sunday, pisanki are thrown in a basket with other food items, most notably white sausage, bread, horseradish, salt and cake, and taken to church for a blessing. The following day, as the sun rises on Niedziela Wielkanocna, families come together for the feast sharing food from the basket and indulging in numerous traditional dishes. Zurek, Markowiec, Mazurek, Sawatka Jazenova and many more. Wielkanoc doesn't end there, however. The following day is Schmigus Dingus, known in the West as Wet Monday, which is dominated by public water fights and everyone being given a carte blanche to drench anyone they see with water. So if you see any children lurking around with water pistols, move fast. So what does your Kvietchen look like? And how do you celebrate Easter? Does it look the same as it does in Poland? Leave a comment below. And while you're at it, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel. Just remember to click the bell for notifications. And you can join the Poland in Your Pocket community on Facebook and Instagram. We look forward to seeing you next month. Do zobaczenia!